Hello everybody and welcome back to another new vlog. Thank you for joining me once again. Um, as you'll see, I'm inside today at home um, and that's because the weather is blowing an absolute gale outside. And if I try and uh, take this on-camera microphone that I've got outside with me, you won't hear any of what I'm saying because of the wind. I can take the microphone off the camera and hold it closer to me, but it's only got a very short cable on the uh, cat on the uh, microphone itself. I'd like to talk to you today about printing your own images. If you're a photographer, whether you shoot landscapes, macros, portraits, or even just sports photos at events and um, family snapshots, then you really ought to be printing your images because there's nothing better than seeing your images in print. I'd like to show you a few of mine, but before we do that, please remember to like and subscribe and leave me any comments you want to because all of that interaction really does help this channel. Um, I'm gonna move on and show you some of my images now. So I hope you like these. The first image that I'd like to show you is this one here. I don't know how well you can see that. This is going back about five or six years ago now. This is a shot taken in Birmingham city centre, walking along the canals in Birmingham. I spotted this image and I was really taken by the boat on the one side of the image. Um, that actually isn't there anymore. That's been moved and that uh, space has been slightly more developed since then. So. I couldn't possibly go back and capture this image ever again because the scene has changed so much since I was last there. Um, so that's the first one. I was really impressed with that and I love the fact that it's come out so well on a print. I love the reflections in the water down here um, and all of the colour variations that I've got. The blues and the whites and the reds of the boats and the greens and everything that's uh, going on with this image. So I hope you like that one. The next image that I wanted to show you is this one. This was also taken in Birmingham along the canals. Um, this is a pub called the Canal House, which yes, I've frequented two or three times. Um, it's a lovely place, but I was just really uh, impressed with the way the uh, sunlight came through the clouds and created this sun star here at the top which was very nice it kind of contrasted well with all the black and white that's going on around it i um, deliberately decided to shoot this as a black and white image um, it's not one that's being shot in color and then converted to black and white afterwards this is a black and white image right from the very start uh, and i just like the fact that you've got the wooden building on the top here at the top here um, surrounded by all the brickwork around the edge around this edge here and the path running along the side of the canal those made a very nice contrast and framed the image very well so I was really impressed with that one the next image that I wanted to show you is this one here I uh, decided to have this printed onto canvas purely and simply because at the time I received a voucher via email for a free canvas print with one of the print companies online. So I decided that I was going to use that to have this particular print printed on canvas. Um, I did have to pay for postage and the canvas print itself, this size, wouldn't have been particularly expensive. However, it was just nice to get something that I didn't have to pay for. Um, the image was shot in Sutton Park last October, so about four or five months ago now. Um, and basically I was just walking through the woodland looking for some possible inspiration when I came across this shot. There is a vlog that includes this shot as I was taking it and the reason that I took it and what it was that inspired me. And I think the most important thing about it was the way these trees all lead you towards these trees at the back and the leaves along the path lead you all the way to these trees at the back and then there is this shaft of light just on these leaves here these bright green and yellow leaves at the top there um, that was kind of perfect and created a lovely composition with 
the trees framing the image around one side. Um, but again, that's one that I decided to have printed because I just love the image to be quite honest with you. And I thought it would look great as a print and I'm really pleased that I did. I hope that seeing some of my images in print will give you a bit of inspiration to go ahead and print your own images in the future. Um, like I said earlier, there's nothing more enjoyable than seeing your own photos actually on a print and perhaps put somewhere on somebody's wall or exhibited in an exhibition or basically sold. Um, it's great to see that the work that you've done um, and all that effort that you've put in and the time that you've used to create such a beautiful image will look good as a print like that. So I hope you have enjoyed those images. I do have a couple more images as well that I've printed but I can't show you those because they've been given to various family members as presents over the past few months. So uh, if you've enjoyed this vlog and if it's helped you in any way please remember to like and subscribe um, and you can send me any comments you like and get in touch with me and let me know what you think. Um, and for now I will see you again on another video very soon. Bye for now.